A disabled Trutland County man is sentenced for growing marijuana behind his house. Yeah, he says he was using it for medical reasons. WJCL's Rob Macko is in court for the sentencing and joins us for the very latest in the story. Hey, Rob. Hey, guys. Yeah, Terry Altier suffers from a degenerative disease in his spine. Now, he says that he could not afford the drugs he was prescribed, so he grew his own. Prosecutors asked the judge to sentence him to three years in prison. Altier and his defense attorney pleaded for leniency. 47-year-old Terry Altier suffers from a degenerative spinal disease. He admits he grew seven marijuana plants behind his house in Soperton. Deputies discovered the patch in October 2012. They'd been out looking for a dog that had a bucket stuck on its head. Altier was charged with a felony, manufacturing marijuana, and pleaded guilty six months ago. At Wednesday's sentencing hearing, Altier's doctor testified he was prescribed Marinol, a synthetic form of marijuana. Other drugs caused nausea and weight loss. The Marinol was meant to increase his appetite and relieve pain. Altier says Marinol cost $3,700 a month. The generic stuff was $900. He says he couldn't afford Marinol and his insurance wouldn't cover it either. He says he couldn't control the dosage, but says he could if he smoked pot. Prosecutors asked the judge to sentence him to three years in prison, while defense attorneys pleaded for mercy. Judge Gibbs Flanders sentenced him to seven years probation and a $1,500 fine. The court sees no meaningful benefit to be getting by a prison sentence in this case. Altier talked to WJCL News after the sentence was read. I'm very relieved. Um, I would think that they, I would have been hopeful that they would have just dismissed it. He's obviously suffering terribly. And this is clearly a, a use of marijuana to treat himself. That's not the sentence that we were asking for. We were asking for something significantly higher. But the process was followed. The result was what it was. And, you know, I, I'm not going to, to try to second guess the judge after the fact. Altier told the judge he's sorry for growing the pot and says he won't do it again. But with that being said, his advice for people in similar situations may surprise you. I say you take your chance on growing it. I will never grow it again. But I'm saying you take your chance on growing it. But if you get caught in the state of Georgia, your outcome may not be as fortunate as mine. Altier could have received 10 years in prison, but prosecutors agreed to cap the request at three years. Now, 49 states allow Marinol and medical marijuana is legal in 20 states. Georgia lawmakers continue to look at this issue even after a bill failed in the state legislature this year. Altier's attorney believes that what his client did now won't be illegal five or maybe 10 years from now. We'll have to wait and see, but you know, more and more states are now allowing medical marijuana. True. Who knows, but you know, both believe that five, 10 years from now, it might not be a crime. And they may be right. All right, thank, thank you, Rob. Rob.